What is this? Look what the cat dragged in. <laughs> What's up, brother? What's up, buddy? How you doing? Come on in, man. Let's talk. All right. <laughs> okay. Uh, what's your name, buddy? Well, my friends call me Big Nye. Good enough, man. You right. ready to go explore some stuff or what? Let's do it. All right, let's roll. Ready for this? Let's do it. Let's do it. All right. That's a, that's a boy. What's it say? That's called. It's calling it the brick brick factory, right? Yeah. But I don't know. I'm not getting real good signal out here, so I'm not exactly sure if we got to go out this way or down through the woods this way. Oh, it's on my phone. Heading east on Cooper's Road towards Savoy Boulevard, Woodmansey Road. Then turn left on Savoy Boulevard. There's an Indian burial ground out here? Yeah, when we were kids, uh, we used to ride our bicycles out here in the woods. And um, off the road, about 30 feet or so, you could see some old headstones. And I, you know, over the years, I've looked up the history of it. And uh, there was actually, you know, it, it was an Indian burial ground. And uh, the woman who, initially told us about it as kids she has passed away now but very interesting lady and um you know she stumbled upon it one day and told us about this and we came out and checked it out you know we've always been interested yeah. in that sort of thing and happened to find it but that was many years ago and I, I wouldn't even know where to find it now but it's right out here in these woods if we now would be a perfect time to explore it because of all yeah. the leaves being gone Yep, here's where the people park. Spray paint in the road. So it's over here somewhere, huh? Yeah, and I don't think you could drive over the train track. One way or another, we're going to get in there with the truck. I'm not really into hiking. <laughs> not into hiking. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> so we're going to get in there with the truck because we're not, he's not a hiker. I'm a hiker. He don't want to hike. He's a four-wheel driver and, a, you know. I just don't want to hike. No? Yeah, I, I don't blame you, buddy. Plus, what if you gotta get out of there in a hurry? True, very true. Okay. Yeah, don't worry. Just go around the cones. They're there for. Um, oh, they're there for a reason to keep us out. This is our town. You can't keep us out. Come on, I, you know we grew up here. There's got to be some leniency. You know, yeah. the private property, no trespassing. Uh, does that really mean what it means, or is that just for some people? I, I, it don't mean anything to me. This is state woods now. The very last video had no trespassing. Uh, we're there for a good cause. We're not there to, uh, maybe it's for the people that's coming here and spray painting the roads and, you know, well, all that stuff. You I'm know definitely what I mean? not here to wreck any historical landmarks. Right. No, we're just here to explore it. Or tear up the woods in any way or, you know. Want to see a part of history that's in our town that we've never seen before. If it comes with fines, it comes with fines. It's all right. We're coming up on this nasty looking hole. I what? don't know if we're going to make it. Um, whoa, oh, oh, man, I don't know, dude. It looks pretty bad. You can't even see it right on camera. You can't, oh, man. Until, yeah, somebody probably had 44 inch tires coming through here. I got water coming in the doors. Oh, no. I don't think we're going to make it, dude. My feet are getting wet. You got a Chevy. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Chevy. <laughs> Like, is that a guitar? Oh, nice, nice ovation. Yeah. What's up, bud? Ovation? Yes. Very nice. You just scared that guy, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Look at 
look at what they've done to this place. <coughs> I don't know the history of this. We're gonna find out. But um Yeah, there's people look. Why would you ruin such a I know, dude. important thing? <laughs> we roll up in a car. Everybody else hikes like miles to get here, dude. We just roll up front row. Compliments big nye over here. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <coughs> Yeah, I've never been out here either, dude. There's a lot of, uh, it's colorful. And I smell paint. Do you smell paint? Oh, were there? Interesting. Oh, yeah, this is fresh stuff. Still wet. Definitely. It happened today. It's crazy. This uh, is insane. It's actually pretty good, though. What's that say? D uh, d oh, die. Die? <laughs> di dime? Dime two? I don't know what that says. I hear something over here. You hear something? What the hell is that noise? I hear spray paint. <laughs> Yo, I, I hear spray paint. smell it. Terracotta. This is crazy, dude. I want to bring the truck out here. Climb over the trees. This is like a tunnel. These holes are weird. Oh my gosh, dude, look at this. So wait a minute, what the heck is under here though? We're wired, you know what I mean? Like, this must be for some reason. I don't know, are we in an old chimney or something? Like, in a chimney itself? Who knows? Definitely gotta look into this, but it's like you can feel the history. I mean, there's just garbage. Watch your head, you're about seven and a half feet tall. Ugh. Head in a shot <laughs> after that. <laughs> Whoa, uh, careful. Uh. I don't know if I, this is too smart. Um, I've got one foot there, I got one foot there. Uh, if I fall in the middle, that's good. If this foot slips over there. I need to say nothing else. <laughs> you won't be able to say anything else. Exactly, except for... <laughs> Your voice will be a, a couple different pitches. This is a obstacle. The last thing we were on was an obstacle. You didn't get to go to the last thing, and you ought to. That was interesting. That was interesting. Oh, look, look at the view from here. This is great. Definitely makes me want to find out you know exactly what went down here.
making it. Just uh. All right, guys. I'm just gonna check uh, check the audio here real quick. Make sure you can hear me. You're gonna hear an echo, probably. All right, guys. I'm just gonna check. Uh... All right. How's this look, everybody? Does it sound good? Does it look good? Let me know real quick uh, if you can share the video. Um, you know, share it on Facebook and wherever you can uh, share things. Hey, Bram. Good to see you, bud. Brian, how you doing, pal? <laughs> All right, looks good, looks good. Perfect. Um, listen, I wasn't gonna do this today, but I decided to do it, to actually just do it. Um, I've been really pushing myself a lot lately, so uh, yeah, I definitely shouldn't be here doing this right now, but you know, sometimes this will, uh, make you feel better hey vicky happy new year to you i hope you're doing well hope everything is good down there all right looks pretty good all right so check this out i'm not going to go real long i know i say that every time but you know for three and a half four years that i've been doing this i i've only used a handful of these black canvases right here and um they're easy. I mean, they're really, they're super easy. If I would have known um, just how easy these things were, I would have been using these for a much, much longer time just because they're easy. You already have your dark color down in there. So uh, you can probably, I don't know if you can see this. It's a little bit shiny. Um, I put this stuff on over here. I'm going to hold it up here for you so you can see it. It's just, uh, it's like floral painting medium. That's all it is. Can you see that? Hold on. It's not going to be in focus, but it's the only floral painting medium that uh, he has. Yeah. The reason that's out of focus is because I have it focused on, on this area right here and nothing closer to the camera. So anyways, I just put some of that on here. Um, I didn't put any color down at all. So I'm going to just... Uh, I'm just going to attempt to make something easy here, all right? Um, and I don't want to go too long because I'm just like, uh, I'm tired. I'm so tired. That little thing that you saw in the front here or in the beginning of this video, um, I don't know. I'm just doing something different also, something that's uh, fun that I've always been interested in. Interested in. And uh, I thought now would be a good time, you know, because... Uh, you just don't know how long you got here on this world. I know I don't know. None of us do. You know, tonight could be the night. Who knows? So I want to do everything I can. Um, and that's why I've been pushing myself, working on a lot of things um, that um, you guys will get to see this year coming up. I hope you guys enjoy a lot of the stuff that uh, I have coming up. And uh, if you don't, you know, that's fine too. All right, all right, okay, so because we're using the black canvas, I got just the same colors. These are the color. actually, these are the colors from, uh, <laughs> they're just left over from the video I made the other day, you know, my last, uh, my last video. Sorry about that, by the way. Caught a lot of shit for that. But, you know, what's life without a sense of humor? If you don't have um, a sense of humor, I like watching people that, that have a sense of humor, you know what I mean? So I try to have a sense of humor. <laughs> because we're using a black canvas, um, I can put color down first, I guess, or I could just try to make, you know, a lighter color, like for a sky, which I'll probably do it that way. So I'm going to just pop in like a little bit of a blue sky. So I'm going to just take some blue, you know, and some white to do that. So if I start like slurring or sounding anything like a little weird, I, I just, uh, I just want to say one more time. I am just like, I don't want to say I'm run down, but I think I'm run down a little bit. 
in it's in a good way though. Um, I've, I've just like this morning. Okay, so first of all, let me just give you a scenario real quick. Um, me and a friend of mine, uh, Niles, one of my best friends for 30 some years. We went out and looked at this place in the uh, in the woods the other day, and uh, I got home late last night. I edited the video until like 5.30 this morning, and then I went to sleep and got up at 9, and uh, I was out all day when I really should have just uh, stayed in bed. So, yeah, anyhow, enough of that. You don't want to hear my issues. It's not even an issue. Let's make a blue sky. Take some white. How does that look? Yeah, you can see that. So look, because it's a black canvas, super easy. Get some white on there first, right? And then just take a little bit of blue, maybe a little black too. You see that right there? Maybe a little more white. And then you could just work with it at this point. You can do what you want. You see, you can start popping it in. Mm-hmm. Let's see here. Why does that look like it's lagging? Am I lagging? That screen is lagging over there. Tell me if I'm lagging. My phone is like showing really good. I'm gonna get a little bit more blue. No, I'm not lagging, I'm doing good. So I'm gonna pop this color in. Cool, thanks dude, thanks Bram. Yeah, I just saw your message come through. I just saw your message come through. Listen, um, anybody that's on this video right now, look in the comments. See that guy right there, Happy Trees Art? Bram, you see that? Go to his channel and follow him because um, he's doing you know, some cool stuff. So make sure that you go follow him. It's, it's important, I'm asking you to do me a favor. It doesn't cost anything. So I'm gonna bring this down. I think I should leave some of that dark in there as well. So let me just uh, say this. The reason I wanted to force myself uh, to do this, yeah, that's all right. My screen is lagging like crazy over there, but I have two other screens that are looking good. So the reason that I forced myself to do this is because here's the truth. So it doesn't matter if you don't feel good or something or if you're tired or whatever, run down. It doesn't matter what you are. If you can kind of just get yourself to start and do this, it, you generally feel good, you know what I mean, afterwards. So I'm going to set this one inch brush down. I'm just going to grab a clean one, a two inch. And uh, did I put, yeah, I did. I put, uh, it's like a painting medium on. I held it up in front of the camera if you weren't here. Follow who? Everybody write Bram's name in the comments. Put his channel. Somebody put a link or something. Hey, Bram, can you put a link? I'm going to take this dry two inch brush here and see, let me see something here real quick. I'm just gonna twirl some of this color around and see where that kind of puts me. And then I could go lighter, darker, whatever. There's a heck of a glare over here too. Let's see. Now I put this black gesso on here. I don't even know if it's dry yet. I just, uh, nah, I, didn't, I don't buy black canvases. I painted it. Might even be wet still, who knows, with the uh, the black gesso. You see how I didn't put a lot of paint on here first? Let me step back. All right, I'll set this clean brush down real quick. Let's pick up that one inch. All right, get some more white and blue. Share the video if you don't mind. I keep saying that, but do it. Share it. It's free. It doesn't cost anything. Share the video, or if you don't want to share the video, you can just drop me 100 bucks in the chat. Um, it's your decision. It's your life. I'm just going to pop some of this lighter color here. I know that's like pure white, but these things are really, these are fun to use because uh, they're just, e they're really easy. And if you... Uh, if you haven't used one, you should use one on your next, you know, next time that you paint a picture. I'm gonna get some more blue. Oh, let me drop some of that color here. I gotta get some more black into there, just to dull it a tiny bit, or gray it. I mean, blue's a nice color, but sometimes it's like, it's like a fake looking blue. 
if you know what I mean. And I want to leave some dark in here too. That's the whole purpose of these black canvases. They have all the dark color is just kind of like left in there, you know? You know, you know, you know? It's like my word. I say that too much. You know? You know? You know what I mean? You know? You know? So you just mess around with these colors. I'm just using blue, white, and a little bit of black. <laughs> See, I'm sorry if I pissed anybody off um, with that video I made um, that I titled my last video. I thought that was just like the best idea because it, I wasn't lying. I really wasn't. It was the truth. It was my last video. So if you were one of the people that I pissed off, I'm sorry, but um, you need to lighten up and get a sense of humor. So life is too short to be miserable. All right, back to this dry brush here real quick. Let's see what we got. I'm just gonna smooth some of this out and then I'm gonna step back because I have this huge glare coming from this side here. So I. I don't even, I can't even really see like what I'm uh, painting. Oh man, that's so great. I gotta step back. How long have I been on this live? How long have I been doing this? A few minutes? See, I already feel like different than I did when I, before I started. All right, not too bad. We need some more blue. We need some more blue. So I'm gonna try to get on the ball here tonight. Because every time I jump on these live streams, I, the first thing I say is, hey, I'm not going real long tonight. And then when I finish up, I look over and it's like all the other stores are closed. I'm the last person in here. It's kind of a weird feeling. Putting together the Zoom stuff. So uh, um, pretty soon, keep your eyes out for that. Your ears, eyes, I don't, whatever you keep out when, when you're supposed to look for something. You know, the, I don't know the right term. Um, I'm doing like these Zoom classes and they're not gonna be like this. You're gonna be, camera's gonna be all up in the business up here, you know? And there's actually gonna be two cameras and uh, I think it's gonna be like $50 for like, I don't know, four or five hours. It's, it's really actually, um, it's, um, it's a lot of work. To be honest with you, um, if I had to start all over again, I, wouldn't, I just wouldn't even do it because I didn't expect it to be as much as it is, but I'm gonna try to make things like somewhat perfect even though I'm the furthest thing from perfect. Yeah, I will, dude. Definitely. 100%. Yeah, I'll talk to you about that, man. And uh, thanks. You know? And you know, to be honest, um, I think we can do something uh, remotely uh, together as well. Because you can like um, add guests or add clients or add people. You could do all kinds of stuff. So maybe we can, maybe we can do something like that. It's pretty crazy because let's say somebody has a question, you can like, you know, you can attend to their question, you know what I mean? And kind of zoom in and show them different things. So I think it's gonna be a really, really good thing. Um, cool, you can, yeah. I think it's gonna be a cool thing. And I think like to do $50 a person for like four or five hours is, is, is definitely great. Um, a couple people like, let it ruin their lives when I mentioned that before, but I think it's going to be well worth it versus paying $125 and traveling across the country. You know what I mean? What brand of brushes do I use? Okay. So the brushes that I use, so they're mine. They're my brushes. I don't sell them anymore. Um, the closest thing you'll find is the Bob Ross brushes. They're very, very similar. The handles are different. The ferrules are different. Um, and that's pretty, you know, pretty much it. They're just kind of like modified, but um, you could just easily get, you know, the Bo Bob's brushes. If you could find his older brushes, you're even better. The newer ones, um, you'll have to ask people in the comments about that. I don't want to state my opinion. All right, so how long am I going to keep painting this area? How does that look? You know what? I just want to put a bright spot in here. Nice little super duper bright spot. Hey, do you guys follow me on Instagram? 
Does anybody, does everybody on here follow me on Instagram or no? If you don't, you should go over there and follow me over on Instagram because that would make me happy. No, it wouldn't. It would actually. It would make me happier, but it would, you know, make my night. Just go follow me. I'm trying to, uh, I have a plan for Instagram. That rhymed. How's this looking from your guys' view right here? Does it look okay? Let me smooth it out with this soft two inch brush over here. Cool. Oh, wait a minute. I know that guy, Adam. Adam is on here. Hey, Adam, wait a minute. Is this the same Adam? Or wait, are you the same Adam that that I sent the three packages out and they never got to you and then you got the fourth one and the post office broke the painting I sent you? Is that this Adam from New York? I don't understand this. No, I don't know what to tell you. All right, I'm wiping this brush off. Oh, cool, what's up, buddy? I thought it was you. See, I'm good with names. All right, look, so I got this little bright spot in here. All right, so just kind of recap for a quick second. Started off with a black canvas, put a little medium down, no big deal. Didn't do anything else except for take a little blue and a little white, touch a little black, just kind of, it's like a grayed blue. And then I put a boatload of white in there, you know, and, uh, and that's what you got here. It's super easy. But the dark part down here is really where it's gonna like come into play because all the dark color is in already. So I'm just smoothing this out. All right, let me hold on a minute. Let me, give me a second, I gotta block this weirdo. Hold on one second. Hide user, I don't know, does that work? Hide, perfect, wacko. All right. All right, so I'm gonna smooth this out. And this will just kind of take the brush strokes, you know, all that stuff out. All right. Yeah, I do know one thing about the Bob Ross brushes. I have, um, I have a huge big box and I probably have four or 500 of them of the old brushes in there that are never even used. And they're, uh, they're cool, they're good. And they're nothing like the new ones whatsoever. Did everybody share this video? You know, I, I don't even care. But this don't even bother me anymore because I don't even care. But like I was going through YouTube the other day and there was this lady, I forget her name, but she had like 20,000 subscribers on YouTube and she was live on like some random Tuesday or something. And... Um, it was like, yeah, some just random day, like, you know, not like a good time. And she had like 1,800 people watching. And, uh, you know, I don't know. I talked with a couple people about this. Like, is, must be something wrong with me or something. I don't know. Because I think I have 50, almost 50,000 or something like that people on, on YouTube. And I go live and there's never like more than 100 people. So... You know, I shouldn't complain. It's just, I always say that it's me. It, it is, is what I'm doing. But <clears throat> I'm not here because I care about that. It would be nice, actually. You know what? Because if more people would watch, I would actually be able to make this a full-time job. 50, oh, sh do I really, I have 54,000 on here? I thought it was under, I thought I didn't hit 50 yet. Yeah, dude, don't wreck your car, buddy. Don't wreck, man. Ain't that important. Thank you for sharing. I mean, seriously, I mean, I do ask. I only know it takes a second. Uh, let me step back real quick and take a look at this. All right, I don't want to be here all night, so let me, let me do this. I do want to pop a, a little, somewhat of a cloud in here. I didn't, I, yeah, I didn't realize I had 54. That's cool. 54,000, okay. Well, actually, no, that makes it even worse. There's 86 people on here. That says something, and I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. 
It's like Facebook. There, I have 30,000 people on Facebook and I post something and they want me to give them like $60 to, to reach uh, the rest of my followers. Like, it's just amazing. I don't want to talk about that. All right, I'm going to put a little something in here. So I just got some white. I got some white on the fan brush. And uh, let me see. Let me just step back and visualize. I got to get a vision on this real quick. And I'm just going to pop it around this area here. Right down into nothing. Get some more white. See, I'm just popping some white paint in here. Um, bring it down this way. I don't know, when you make clouds, do some goofy stuff. Make it uneven, you know? I think it makes it look a little better. Let me step back again, take a look at that. Put a little bit more, maybe. And then I'll smooth this stuff out. Put some white right there, maybe. You don't have to twirl it, you can just look. You could tap, see? You could tap color in if you want, see that? All right, let me set this down real quick. And uh, go back to this two inch brush here real quick. Now watch, I got a dry two inch brush. Say that five times fast. I'm going to just try to blend it out a little bit and see what it looks like. Just kind of, I'm just dragging it down into the big blobs of white that I put in. I don't even know. I just wanted some kind of weird looking cloud design. All right, now let me show you something real quick. Food or cooking? What the hell? Yeah, dude, just block that guy. I, I mean, I don't, I don't need to see what he said, but so many weirdos out there. Just block them. So check this out. So see how I just did that? You can come back. This is like super easy to do this. Look, I'm going to put a little bit more. See that white? I'm coming in and putting more white in, and then I'll blend that out. And it will, uh, you know, it'll make like a little layer, you know what I mean? See? Now watch. Let me just do one here. Maybe you can see this one better. I don't know. I don't even know if you can see these or not. I'm just putting some white color down. Uh, set that back down. I'm just going to try to make a layer here. I don't know if this will work or not, but it's all right. You know, it won't look like uh, just one cloud or I don't know. It'll look like maybe there's one in front of in front of the other. Get this paper towel real quick. All right. I'm telling you, me and Bram both can show you how to make clouds. You just got to get the, um, you got to get it out of your head that, oh, it's so hard or I can't do it. You know, I, I don't know the last time that I made a video that I didn't tell people like, you got to believe, like if you want to do something, you got to believe it. If you believe it, uh, you know, it, it happens, it just happens, you know. Um, I can't tell you how many things that, that I've done that I've like talked myself into believing that I could do it and then I did it. So I, I was never like that. I sucked at everything in life for many years. I'm just like swatting back and forth. To, Try to get some of these brush strokes out real quick. All right. Let me step back and take a look. How's that looking, everybody? How's that looking? Give me a thumbs up or something or anything. It's hard. It's really hard for me to see. I can see I have these screens, but they're very small, and I can't really tell what I'm looking at. Number three, fan brush. Number three, fan brush is the answer to your problems in life. Trust me. Trust me. All right, here we go. 
I got to step back for a minute and see what what I'm doing because I don't really know what I'm doing. I mean, I, I don't. I'm just. I just started off with a black canvas, and I'm like, I'll make something. Um, I don't even know if I feel like making a mountain today. You know, I mean, like a you know a knife one. So let me um. Hmm. Let me get a filbert. brush there's nick nick's here go follow nick everybody what's up dude yo man that painting is like i'm pretty sure it's good to send out so i'm going to be sending it to you this week bud take it to the post office and get it out to you i framed it for you as well all right all right so i'm just grabbing a filbert brush here i uh so here, like, look, here's the filbert brushes. These are the ones that, that I, these are mine, right? And then I found this one, I don't know, Michael's or something. I mean, there's like no difference, you know? That's why I'm not selling them anymore. Because you can just, you know, you can just buy them. You can buy them. It's not the brush. It's, I promise you, the brush isn't going to make, you know, I don't know. It's going to help you do different things, but the brush isn't going to make or break you, you know? And I tried to prove that in a couple of videos when I use my hands or paper towels to, to make a painting. It's, it's not the brush. So get those thoughts out of your head, you know, um, have the, build the confidence up to know that it doesn't matter what brush you use. You can use anything that somebody throws at you. You know what I mean? You can uh, peel an orange, for example, and give me the orange peels off of that orange and I'll make you a picture with it. You know what I mean? And, and just remember something, just in case there's anybody in the future that watches this, there's a difference between being cocky and confident. Those are two different things. I am confident in this. You know, one of the, you know I'm confident in this. Never cocky. Don't misunderstand that. I'm not going to make a mountain. I'm going to make a hill, though. I'm going to make a couple hills. So let me do this. Move that out of the way. Set this fan brush out of the way and uh, make a color. Let's get a color on here. I want to get like a really light blue green something. So let's see, let's get some blue, steal some white, put it right here maybe, get some green. Let's see how this looks, get some brown maybe, I don't know. It's probably a mistake and that's all right. Go back to the white. If you don't like it, just lighten it up. Hmm. All right, if you're not sure, get it on the canvas. You know what I mean? All right, get it on the canvas. All right, I'm going to step back here for a second. All right, so I got clouds there, so I'm going to try to frame this in, you know, to make it look somewhat okay. So I'll probably start off, you know, over here. I don't even know. Just do it, you know? Take my own advice. Go up, down, up, down. Let me see something real quick. All right, I can live with it. Let me get some blue in here. Let's see, I'm just putting some color, a little bit of color in here. All right. Maybe that comes down like that. All right, let me do this. Um, I gotta set this palette down for a minute. You know, something you can do is, if you want, in the comments, let me know. Uh, let me know what state or country where you're watching from. I always, I always like watching back to see where everybody's watching from. I think it's amazing, uh, amazing time that we're living in. You know, for somebody to be all the way across the world and watch what we're doing. So, drop that in the comments if you don't mind. I'm going to take this one inch brush, I wiped it off, it was the one we used to make the sky, and I'm going to do one of these things here. I'm just going to drag some of this down and try to soften it a little bit. This is supposed to be, whew, out of breath, very far in the background, so let's do this. See? And I'm, I'm trying to leave some of that, like, texture, I guess. I don't even know if it's texture, just, like, movement, different things. Twirl it, swirl it, whatever. Um, I 
Okay, all right. That could be far away, right? Could be. Let me grab the two inch. Two inch brush and I'm gonna just do one of these things here. I'm actually gonna sweep over the whole thing real quick. Set that back down. I'm gonna grab this fan brush right about here with some, uh, with some white paint on it because I'm gonna put another hill, another mountain thingy, thingy in. Uh, but I wanna put a little bit, of, I wanna make it look like there's a little bit of mist. So I'm gonna do this. See this? Put some white paint in here, watch this. Let me step back real quick because I'm, I'm just staring at a glare here. I got some trees I'm gonna put in over here so I don't wanna go too crazy with the paint in that section there. All right, see? Maybe, you know what, what the heck, just put it here too. All right, we can set that back down. And then I'm gonna go back to this two inch and I'm gonna twirl this really good. All right, just twirl it up. And then I'll be ready for us to put another little hill, you know, in front of that. You know, and hopefully, hopefully you'll be able to see it, you know, it'll look like something. I don't even know what I'm doing. This is, I love doing this stuff. Yeah, it's a cool thing about um, social, uh, lots of crazy people. That's cool. Weed them out, you know? Weed them out. Weed the crazy people out. Yeah, don't even, what the hell? Hold on a second. One second. Sorry, I'm just like, yeah. I'm not reading the comments. Tell him out. Yeah, you know why you can't? You have to go to their channel. You have to actually click on their thing and then visit their channel and block them. Um, but it's all right. Yeah, there's some weirdos. I deal with them all the time. You ought to see the messages I get. You ought, to get, you ought to see the messages. Like, I'm not even going to talk about that because it's, it's, it's just ridiculous. And you know what? I said this the other day to a buddy of mine. You know what? Don't even be pissed off at those people that, um, that say stuff like that. You shouldn't be mad at them. I don't get mad at them. You know, people that say negative things to me. And I'm going to tell you why. I'm going to tell you why while I'm mixing color, why I don't get upset with them because anytime somebody says stuff like that crazy negative things, let me just tell you their life sucks. They have all kinds of stuff going on. So I feel sorry for them to be on. I mean, to be perfectly honest, I feel sorry that they're living in whatever they're living in. You know what I mean? So I still block them, but I feel sorry for them. All right, I got blue, black, green, maybe get some of this yellow ochre. I don't even know. Let's try it. Um, I wanted to make another hill up here. Is that right? Hmm. Well, we got to work with it now. Get some more of that color. I don't know. I just look at things like that. That's how I look at stuff. Buddy of mine was telling me about this. He was he was out to eat, and this uh, you know this waitress was just like horrible. He said just completely horrible. Every, just everything was bad, and and I you know I'm like you know chill man. Don't uh, don't be upset at the service that you got because 
you know, little do you know, that waitress, she may go home and may get the hell beat out of her by her husband. Or I don't, who knows? I'm just saying that's how I look at stuff. Maybe I'm a weirdo. I don't, I don't know. I just know that like years back, um, I said a lot of negative stuff. And now when I um, think about it, I know why. Because my life sucked. Everything sucked. So I could be right. I could be wrong. Oh, yeah, don't worry. I, the trolls don't even bother me. Believe me, they don't bother me at all. Like, if they bothered me, I wouldn't be here. I just wouldn't be making videos. Because they're not just in the comments. They, they uh, actually take their time and message me, you know. I'm just throwing color down. We'll, we'll, uh, we will work with it. But no, for real, like, a lot of people have bad lives, and you have to realize that. And some people, so, like, I come on here on YouTube, I want to spread positivity to people right that's what I want to spread I want to be positive some people don't have that some all you know some people just have negativity to spread you know that's all they have it's something right it's something but so don't hate them you know don't hate them because you never know what goes on in somebody's home or behind closed doors feel sorry for them though I promise you feel sorry for them I'm just putting this color in. I'm going to do something here in a second with it. I'm using blue, black, and green. And yeah, that's it. Maybe try a little brown in here. I don't know. Brown's a good color, earthy color. That's right. That's right, Allie. That is correct. You never know. You know, and I've, uh, listen. A lot of people, a lot of, I shouldn't just say people, a lot of women um, send me messages, okay? And uh, let me just uh, say it like this. I never, I never realized how messed up the world was until I've read some of these stories, you know? Um, a lot of people open up to me because I don't judge. You know, and I think you can tell, if you can't tell that I'm a non-judgmental person, then you shouldn't be here anyways. But, um, you know, it really opened my eyes to a lot of things. You know, I feel sorry for a lot of people, and I just would love for people to better their lives. You know, that's my thing. You know, that's why I'm making videos here on YouTube, because when I'm dead and gone, these videos hopefully will be here, you know, after that. Uh, is this the right? Let me get another brush. You know, so that's the goal. Hopefully these videos stay around for, you know, for a long time. I forget where I wrote it. I think it was on, I don't even know where it was. Twitter, Instagram or something. Right on the top, I had it, I, I wrote, and you can laugh at me if you want, but I wrote it right on there so people could see it. Um, I said, I will change the world, right? I wrote that. And uh, somebody somebody sent me a message, and they were, like, calling me all these names and whatever. Um, and it didn't bother me, which is, I don't know. It was some pretty bad stuff. It didn't bother me, though, because, listen, I'm on a mission here. I'm on a mission. Whether I succeed or fail, I'm not worried about that, you know? Because in my eyes, I haven't, I, I, I succeeded further current to the current day than I ever thought in a million years. So, if you want to do something, start believing it. Let me see, I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't even, this is great, right? I have no clue what I'm doing. I don't know where I'm going. I'm just trying to, uh, what am I doing here? Uh, let's see here. And I'm just grateful for the people that write stuff like what you just did. Like, you know, thank you for giving me credit for that. But just remember, that's like, you look, you took the initiative to listen to the advice that I'm off, you know, that I was trying to offer to you. You know what I mean? Um, if I was a tree, what kind of tree would I be? Hmm. I'm not even going to answer that. No comment. Yeah, totally different, right? Because I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just sitting here. But watch, we're going to transform this into something. So just, just bear with me, okay? 
bear with me here. Let me just, let me get, which college did I, which college did you teach Clint? All right, like so, all right, hold the phone, pause for a minute. Sherry D. All right, just, I'm not going to answer that because is this like, is this a, are you asking me a serious question or are you trying to be funny right now? I'm going to sit here and wait. Oh, that was for Bram. I was about to say, don't ask me that. Bram, he's like a master at everything. Bram, he's like a, uh, Bram's like a, uh, what is this? Like a professor or something, right? Bram's a smart dude. And if you haven't followed him yet, you need to go over there and follow him because he, uh, yeah, I see that now. That's the problem with trying to read comments, dude, and, and actually do something that I have no clue what I'm doing. But I'm interested now in seeing what people are saying. I'm a lawyer and teach. See that? Go follow Bram. If, and, you know, if you get a DUI, all you got to do is uh, hit him up on uh, YouTube and tell him, say, hey, Bram, I, you know, listen, I follow your paintings. Um, I got a DUI. Can you rep? I'm just kidding. I'm just, I'm so kidding, dude. Actually, I'm not kidding. I don't know what kind of lawyer you are, but, you know, I think lawyers are all the same thing, right? All right, I'm going to put some white in here. I'm not done with this. You see this big blob of stuff right here? I'm going to put some stuff. Watch how I bring this to life here in a second. Watch this. I'm going to get some white paint and watch this. Oh, my God. I should read. I should just shut my mouth. All right, so I want to put some trees in. All right, so look, I want to put some trees in, but because this is a black canvas, you you have to have things in there that separate. You got to have separators. I guess that would be the right word. So I'm thinking. Okay, let me do this. Let me do this. I'm going to put this in back here because I think I should put, yeah, that'll work. That's going to work. I'm just going to blend this in a lot more than the ones up top. So I'm just like getting it ready. I'm just setting it up. I'm just setting this up is all that I'm, I'm doing at this point. And if you don't, if you don't want to keep something, you don't have to keep it. But I'm just, I'm, now I'm really, I'm, if you're wondering, I'm really trying to visualize because I may have really done it here on this one. Um, mm -hmm. Let me see here. I want to go back this way like that. All right, hold on a second. I'm just trying to figure out how to save this one at this point. So this is a good one to watch because this is one of them ones where uh, I'm like, ooh, what the hell did I just do? All right, so there's some mist there, all right? Smooth that out real quick. Not done with all this up here yet. But let's make something into this right now. All right, let me grab this one inch brush here. Wrong color. That's so funny. You actually you hold your breath breath because of because of that uh, great setup for Smoky Mountain. Starts throwing color in the middle of his paintings and it makes me hold my breath. Here, I, you know what? Just because you said that, hold on. I got I got to do something. I got to do something funny. Hold on a second. So here. Wait, who said that? Did it? Was it, uh, yeah, Tracy, here you go. All right, Tracy, hold your breath. That was like a good idea, hold on. Hmm, all right, so I'm gonna, st hold your breath, Tracy. Look, let me use two fingers on this one. Black, blue, green. You holding your breath, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> hold on a minute. Hold on, I'm wipe my hands off. You know why I do stuff like this, right? 
See my hands? Do you know why I do this stuff right? Shoot. Hold on one second. Hold on. Looking for these uh, baby, all right, I got them, baby wipe things. All right, now, don't panic. Do I look like I'm panicked to you guys? Do I look like I'm panicked? Whoa. All right, here we go. So I did that for a reason, right? Number one, to, ma <laughs> to make you uh, hold your breath, because you said it, and you said when you said throw and paint, it just gave me the idea. So yeah, right, exactly. I want you to see, um, just so just, I want you to look at this for a few minutes. Look at, oh my gosh. I'm gonna start bringing gloves into the live streams because I tend to do this often. So let me just wipe my hands off here. Well, hell, that just got me some uh, more viewers over on uh, Facebook. <laughs> Hang on one second. Almost done, almost done here. Okay, so now, so for most people out there, I ruined the painting, right? Get that out of the way, here we go. Okay, back to reality. Clean hands. Ugh. Fix, uh, oh, Jesus, hold on. All right, so watch, we're gonna, we are going to show you how to control your life here, okay? I just really don't want to get this paint in my eyes. All right, let's pick the palette up. All right, let's start back here into this section here. Don't let this bother. I know this is going to bother so many people, so I'm going to leave it for a few minutes. This will help you. Um, like, this will help you. Self-control. Just don't look at it. Let's do something with this over here. So let's go over here and let's get some yellow. I'm going to pull some out. See that? Pull some yellow out. And get some green. Get some green. Nice green, yellowish color, right? All right. So yellow, just yellow and green. Nothing fancy. I'm going to get some of that yellow. Tap this one inch in there. And see what we can do here. All right. So I'm going to start right about here. And... Well, hello. Hello there. Tracy Buford. Oh, wow, look at that, 50 bucks. Hey, if I ruin it, if I ruin the left side, will, I, will that be 100? No, I'm just kidding. I'm not really kidding. We should do that. We should do this thing where I just gotta ruin the picture so many times. Every time I ruin it, you gotta do super chats and I have to fix it. It's like a mission. All right, so I'm just thinking the layout. I'm just trying to show you here, like, you know, stuff can be fixed, guys, don't panic. Thank you, Tracy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You've given me so much money. Thank you. I really appreciate you. And uh, you know, I was just joking when I said, like, hold your breath and all that. I was just trying to be funny and trying to entertain you. You know, that's all. All right, so I'm thinking about little hills and thingies. So let me just go up here and get this out of the way making them uneven and things like that. Green and yellow. I'm just using green and yellow. Tra <laughs> That's cool. Well, thank you. I'm glad. I am so glad. I'm just, uh, see, I'm just making something here. And uh, maybe for the people that stay till the end, I'm going to... Uh, I'll, I'm going to wipe the entire thing at the very end, unless somebody buys it. That's the new thing. Live streams, all, they're going to be wiped. I'm going to just ruin, just ruin them, unless somebody wants to buy it. <laughs> I don't think I should have did a live stream tonight, but see, look, I'm doing, I mean, you could fix stuff. I mean, for real, guys, like, just trying to help you here. I got to step back, because, you know, the funny part is, uh, I can't see what I'm doing. There's a this big glare. Oh, cool, somebody became a member. That's awesome. Thank you to Christy Hernandez. You are much appreciated. I don't think you guys realize how much I appreciate stuff like that. I really don't think you do. 
I don't think you do. But look. I mean, sir, do I look worried about what I just did? I mean, that look at this. Look, I mean, this. I mean, you got to be honest. If if uh, I walked into your house right now and I did this, would you be upset? It would ruin your painting, right? You'd be upset. Don't be upset. There's a way around it, and you're going to learn from it as well. Thanks, Nick, for answering that. I just saw it. Okay. So look, I'm just making little things here. See, little areas and little hills and stuff. Get some more yellow in there. Thank you, Christy. I definitely love you. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, so now we got like these like little areas. I want to leave a little dark down here, but like look, you know, just little different layers and things, you know? See? You could do all kinds of stuff. It just, you know, could look like little hills. Make some of them connect. And this is kind of like a base color, you know? some more yellow in there. And this goes right in front of this cloud, see? I have no problem with wiping this. I, I mean, in case that was that, that's what that comment was for, but like, I, I have no problem, seriously, with wiping this entire painting, you know? I mean, just, I mean, because it can be made again you know, sending love from Texas. All right. You are very welcome. Thank you for being here. Texas. I remember I heard a song before. It said, all my exes live in Texas, which is just funny. But if that's even a real song, I don't know. I've been to Texas before. the finger paint yeah I'm a weirdo too don't worry about it don't worry about it be a weirdo seriously don't listen please don't let this bother you you know what and if that bothers you like if you said that's helping you right just like sitting here looking at this don't let it bother you don't let that bother you we're gonna learn from this in a second just sit tight sit tight I'm doing this because I'm not doing this to be like uh, like um, weird I'm doing this because um, serious, like you're gonna benefit from this, okay? So just relax, relax, just for a minute. Oh, damn, I think I, uh, I think I was a little too much. It wasn't, it wasn't too much. Just, just calm down, hang, hang in there. All right, how's these hills looking? Let me put a little highlight color on the hills. And you know, I love doing stuff like this because it creates a, like a little challenge, sort of. And I don't know if you're the type of people that likes challenges at all. I love challenges. I love them. Love challenges. Let me see, is my microphone good? Yeah. Last time my microphone died. Oh man, I gotta get on the ball here. All right, let's get a little bit of bright color here, a little bit of more yellow. I just wanna brighten it up just a hair, you know what I mean? Um, all right, so let's just say just so I can move on, you know what I mean? I just want to put a few little, you know, little areas that maybe will stand out. You know, just a, just not too many, just like a couple little things, you know? Because if you put too many highlights on, you're gonna kill everything. So just put a few, don't put too many, you know? All right, so that's probably good enough. We can work on that later. Um, yeah. But I gotta figure out what I'm doing here. Let me just put a little, little uh, kind of like a guideline for myself here real quick. So I wanted this to drop downward. I wanted this to be like, you know, some of it goes behind the cloud, some of it goes in front, you see? Something like this, I don't know. We'll figure that out in a minute. Little hill of some sort right there, or maybe not. Maybe it's like misty in here, which you can do that just by tapping, you know? I'm probably gonna wipe that off anyways. Um, all right, next. Next, some dark color. Let's get some, uh, 
Let's get some dark color here. Let me get this filbert out of the way before I get some more ideas and start really messing something up. So I'm just going to get some blue, black, and uh, some green. Okay, yeah, looks good. I'm going to map in something here real quickly. Everything's real quickly. You notice that? Real quickly. And it never is real quickly whatsoever. It's always real not quickly. I'm just mapping in a little bit of color, dark color. Let's do this. Let's do one of these guys here. Yeah, I knew we wouldn't keep that. See? I didn't like the light color, so put put dark back in. Mm. All right. Now I'm going to put a little bit more dark color on this side. No particular. Thanks, Nick. You didn't have to do that, bud. You didn't have to do that. Thank you, though, man. I can't wait. And I just got to warn you. Listen, I saw the one that you made for me. It's a thousand times better than the one. Uh, I, I made that's my opinion like so it's so much better dude you're so good man tell everybody about you I tell everybody about you dude um, all right enough of this right Let me just put some color in I know it's gonna bring it probably this way and maybe just add this wrap that way okay good enough all right let me visualize here for a second of uh, how I can live up to uh, this big mess on the left hand side here um okay wipe this one inch brush off right first thing i'm going to do is try to get a little control over you know some of me hold this here i'm just going to kind of do this watch i'm just i don't you know this may not be a real tree of any kind but i'm just getting rid of these edges first right so in my pea-sized brain, when I look at this, I'm like, you know, you got to get rid of the, the rectangle looking thing here, right? So maybe it's going to be background trees. I don't know. See? So I'm going to come in here. All right. You know, this could be stuff in the background, right? But my point here is, I told you, don't worry. Life is too short. Life is too short to worry. No wonder nobody wanted to buy it. They were looking at it like, we ain't buying that thing. You crazy? You crazy? See, I'm just tapping, see? Just tapping something in there. Whether this is background, color, we don't, I don't know what it is. It's something, right? Let me fix this real quick. Probably make that dark. Okay. All right, now, I think I'm going to make this like background, uh, some kind of a background something, because I'm looking at it, and I can put stuff in front of that, and I'm going to show you real quick. Uh, let me get some... So I'm going to get some yellow and some green on here, right? Yellow, green, and like some yellow ochre, a little blue, just some weird color with some white. It's all weird colors here, guys. Nothing but weird colors going on. Something subtle, maybe not. A lot of white. Lighten it up. All right, here we go. Let's see if that more white. A lot more white. Blue. More blue. So I have a very light green blue color here. I'm smashing my brush into it, okay? Smashing my brush into it. And you know what, just for the heck of it, I guess we could just take like a filbert or something 
And just draw a few lines in here. Just it, I'm thinking background stuff at this point, for real, you know? Thinking background stuff, so. All right, a little branch there, 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 wherever, right? Okay, move this out of the way. Get my nice little weird color I got going on here. White, it's like a light blue, green, white, yellow, yellow ochre. Don't ask me how to mix it, because I don't know. A lot of blue, a lot of white, and a lot of weird thoughts. Okay. totally bobbing this one that's for sure because it's the easiest thing to do you know this is just background stuff so I'm trying to make it subtle you see and darker towards the bottom so it doesn't it doesn't stand out too much you know Very subtle down at the bottom here because it's we want it to be dark. Very, very dark. You know, it could be just whatever. Make this a little bigger. Change the angles. See? All right. You get the idea. So that's like something. That's cool. I mean, hey. No, I am not thinning anything. I'm just putting tons of paint. Here, I'll show you. Thinning nothing at all. See this pile right here? That's uh, blue, white, a little bit of green, a little bit of black. It's just a lot of paint. And I'm just, you know, a lot of paint, less pressure. All right. Now, let me wipe this one inch brush off right here. And uh, we'll start highlighting some of the ground. So on this side, I'm going to use just like uh, some green, like a light green or something. So let me get some of that going here. Green and uh, yellow. Just a you know, lighter color. So I have green and yellow for this side. Start making some grass. Right? So I'm going to do this. Look. See? A little darker. It's too light. Here, yellow ochre maybe, that's always a good thing. Bring that right. All right, just making little, you know, something here, I don't know, a little hill. Okay. And then uh, let's see here. I know it looks like I'm going to bring something down here, a little color on it there, maybe. Let me just get this out of the way here. I want to put something right here. You see? I'm not thinning anything, I'm just tapping. Just tapping some color. Let me fix that. Looks very moody. I didn't pull any reflections down. I'll do that in a few minutes. I want this to drop right down like that. This will go here. I'm just like, I'm like beating the hell out of this brush. I want it to be, whoops. I want it to be very, very, like, you know, I want the bristles to be like super spread out. You just get a better uh, result that way. Keep the bottom there dark. Let me go over to the other side here. Let me wipe this off. Some yellow in here. 
a little bit of a brighter color. Because maybe the sun's coming that way, you know? So let's do this. More yellow. This is a lot of yellow. This is like all yellow. I mean, this is like probably, yeah, this is a lot. Because I want it to be bright. So I'm using a lot of it because I want it to stand out. And that's why I'm doing that. I'm not thinning nothing here. <clears throat> I'm, just, I'm just hitting the areas, you know, that I want to be bright first. And then I'm just going to work a little bit of that color down, you know. Okay. Let me figure out the layout here. I want that to wrap around. Maybe I'll have some coming this way. This. So I'm just trying to, I don't know, visualize some stuff here. Some yellow ochre and, and some yellow. <clears throat> and uh, figure out. It's going to come off this way, so. Let's put something in here. Just making just little movements and stuff you know and we'll pull some down for reflections you know um you know you know you know you know what i mean you know does anybody not know did i keep saying you know here let's uh whew, i'm sweating fan brush gets just some white paint on there a little bit of white well you know you know what white blue where's this we got some blue in the sky so make this super easy you know i'm gonna do this uh I'm going to pull some blue down the middle, like that. Okay. And then I'm going to wipe the fan brush off. And I'm just going to pretty much yellow and green for everything else. Not a big deal. I'm going to mainly come down uh, too much. Get some green. And a little black to dull that. So I want to leave some of the black in here. I'm just going to put the color in. I'm not going to make the little stuffs. All right, I'll probably have to fix that down there. Mm. Wipe this off. All right, one second here. Let me just think. Um, I'll just take this two inch, I guess. I'm gonna take this and uh, pull this down. Let's see if this works. I can fix stuff. I'm not worried about it. If I hit the green or whatever, I'm just gonna do this. Uh, probably use the corner, maybe. I don't know. Pull it on an angle. It doesn't matter. I'm just pulling it down. I'll fix that down here. I am not worried about that whatsoever. All right, let me wipe that off real quick. Just, you know, give us something. You want to put a little, you want to give it a little, uh, you want to make it stand out, get a little white on here if you want, and just kind of go. See? Just put a little bit here and there. Just like that. And then. Pull that down. See? Don't take your time, just, <clears throat> just pull it down. Now, swat it back and forth. All right, gives us something, right? Now, let me uh, look at it. Go back to this one inch brush here. Yellow, green, all of that stuff. I'm just gonna touch up, watch. Touch a few things up here, see? Touch that up. Touch the edges up down here. Touch this guy up there. You see, you could touch all these things up. It's no big deal. It takes less than uh, however many seconds this is gonna take. All right, put a few little things here, there. You know, um, and then maybe one last guy here, something like that. All right, so there's a couple little touch-ups. And if you want to, you know, you could technically soften a little bit to pull some of the areas you just touched up down. You could do that. Not a big deal. 
grab a knife. Let me grab the knife here. And I'm just gonna take some white and uh, there's a little bit of blue, just like a bluish white color. So it's just white with a little blue. And I'm gonna try to um, bring it together. All right, try to make it make sense. So I'll start back here. Get some more white. There, yeah, there you are. Bring this right around. See, make it make sense. Same thing on the other side. Make a line there, goes right off the canvas. Make them wrap around. You see what I mean? It just, you can make it look like running water or whatever. You can do, just do whatever you want. You don't have to do any of that stuff. I'm just saying you can. I'm just trying to show you. You know? You got a little line there. You know, it just kind of gives you something, you know what I'm saying? You know, you know, you know, you know? All right, like the knife. Wipe the old knife off here. All right. Let me grab um, a number three fan brush real quick. So I'm going to take uh, blue and some black and green, just dark color, it's dark. Put some crimson in there too, crimson, whatever you call it. Dark color. And I want to do something right about maybe here, I don't know, right there. The number three fan brush, I like these fan brushes a lot. You know, just to offset that big, you know, pile of garbage in the back. It'll kind of set it straight. Get some more green in there. Just pop in a few little, you know, just something to, something to distract your eyes, you know. Put a couple shadows in here. feel like I want one here too. Just like a little less noticeable, maybe just a little one. You know? You know? You know? You know? Little things growing. Little things growing and doing whatever. You know, making little lines and things all over real quick. All right, man, I am freaking, I'm burning up. Very, 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 uh, I'm like really hot. Bet my temperature is like 103 right about now. I'm just going to put a little different color in there. You, you guys probably won't see this. want it to be, you know, just something uh, different, you know, you know, I'm busting myself from now on for saying that. Okay, let me set that down. Now I'm just grabbing this filbert real quick and some blue and some black. Mm. 
I'm just going to put a tree here. Right about, yeah. Grow the grow right to there. Right off the canvas he goes. Get some more black. And another one right there. You know, you know. You know. Just popping in something here. Gotta say, mind blown. What a great artist you are. Keep positive role. Meanwhile, keeping trying. I right, thank you. I appreciate that, Christy. I appreciate that. Just black and some brown. You know, I want these trees to be kind of, these are big trees. You know, these are huge trees. <clears throat> they make them bigger as they come down. Something like this. Put a few branches on them. We could bring these guys to life here in a second. You know, just pop a few little, you know, somethings here. Maybe this guy has one that grows right next to him like this. And then there's one that goes off that way. This way, this way, it doesn't matter, just whatever way works. Okay, let me wipe the filbert off. All right. Now I'm grabbing white paint because I'm uh, just feeling like white paint right now, a little bit of yellow ochre, and that's to the extent of what I'm doing here. Whew. I am literally burning up. Now watch, I'm rolling the filbert down, just rolling it down. And do the same thing real quick over here. Just rolling it down the side, and I'm gonna stop you know, somewhere, depending on the tree placement. Now like this here, I want this branch to come into the front. This one will run down the side into the back. Okay, like this. And then, you know, you can put a little white on here, there, wherever. It don't matter. Let me wipe this filbert off. All right, and then I'm just going to take this filbert and just kind of, you know, kind of blend this white in a little bit so it's not a hard line. See, I'm going very fast because I've learned that this, if you go slow, it doesn't work. So you go fast and just... You know, just looks better, in my opinion. These are all my opinions, my views, and the way that I see things. These, you know, may not be correct. Um, they're just correct in my life, the way I, the way I see it. I never claim that this is the way to do anything. Patty Kenny, thank you, Patty. You are um, you're awesome. Thank you very much. Appreciate you, very much. Let me get some blue and white here. I told you guys this last time. You can take beautiful blue, just blue and white. And you can just create a, uh, a look on the back side of your trees, something that you may not see in real life, but that's okay. See, a little bit of blue, it just gives it a look. And that's all, you know what I mean? And I'll blend this in here too in a second. Just dropping some of that color in. Okay. Same thing, watch. See, I'm blending that blue around. that baboon that's right <laughs> remember what I said don't be pissed off at them feel sorry for them they probably get beat when they go home seriously 
Let me put a little black in here. I do. My heart runs deep for both of them. For old glowy Chloe. As she's uh, getting, um, I'm just going to shut my mouth, but I'm serious. Nobody spreads negativity unless their life sucks. I did it. I speak from experience. I'm putting black in here just because I felt like it needed it for the contrast. You know, you know, you know. All right. Okay. All right, I'm going to grab a liner real quick because I'm like, wait, I'm over. Oh, yeah, I got to I got to stop here in a minute. So just getting a liner brush. I normally wouldn't even do this, but I'm just going to do it. Where do I get these visions? Come on, man. What, what is this? What is that? Some kind of trick question or what, buddy? Did you get my text, Niles, before I came on here? I texted you. I'm just going to put a few branches in here. See? Not too many of them because, uh, you know, you could sit here all night and make branches. But I want one that comes out like this and just runs this way. You know, just a few to just offset things, you know, or whatever. Putting a few things in the distant background here. You know, they'll just whatever people can watching just want to know. You just want to know. Well, buddy, it's uh, I I don't I don't know. I see things sometimes, and you remember that conversation we had the other day, and I told you I don't say a lot of things because you know you you of all people know that I'm a normal person. I don't want people to think I'm weird. So I, don't, I just don't say anything about something. I just don't talk much when it comes to, I don't know what I'm feeling or maybe if I have an idea, you know, or maybe I've seen stuff before, you know. Just putting a bunch of branches in, just whatever, just slinging them, you know, it don't even really matter where. Um... Let me go back to, um, I'm just going to take some blue and white. The nuts are out. The nuts are out. Did somebody say anything else? Yeah, the nuts are out. That's true. Um, That's it. That's all I'm doing. Going home. Going to bed. Going to bed for a week straight. For a whole week. Can you please give me a heads up when you send the painting out? So I can look for it. Uh, can you um, You got to clarify, bud. I don't know your... I don't know what you... Oh, you're talking... Okay. You're talking about the giveaway one. I got to... Yeah, once make sure that's dry. Is that what you're talking about? I got so many things going on. 
I got so many things going on. Just give me a second. Text number at the top. Yeah, dude. No, I need to. Definitely. Um, it's okay. Can't live without pushing yourself, right? Yeah, okay. No, I just wanted to make sure. I didn't know what you were talking about. But listen, thanks for watching, guys. I wasn't going to do this, but um, I'm glad that I did. You know, and I want to thank all the wackos for watching as well, giving me the opportunity to just, you know, hit the block button because your comment does help the algorithm. So um, I hope that makes you feel great. And sorry about your life. Nick, dude, keep doing what you're doing, buddy. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send your picture out. I, can't, I just can't look at the light right now. So you have to just, I just can't look at the light. I don't want to say anything else right now. I just, um, Nick, I'll let you know this week when I say, send your picture out. And um, that's about it. But uh, I'm going to go because I think, uh, I think I've really, I think I overdid it this time. I really think I've overdone it. I've uh, pushed myself and I love doing that. I love doing that, but I think it's going to, I just, uh, I just feel like I got to go to bed. So take care. I love you guys. Thanks for everything. Um, I know I said I was going to wipe this painting. I'm not going to wipe the painting, even though it doesn't matter because I could just do it again. But, um, take care. I'll see you guys when I see you. God bless you.